What we have here is a sample that's on an Abiti slide. Uh, this is a special kind of sample holder where um, the bottom is very thin plastic uh, that has optical properties very similar to cover glass. Um, so let's go ahead and put this on the microscope. So I'm going to remove this cover so that we can place the sample. Now note that um, we have something that has a slide shape, so I'm using this insert. Um, also note this insert has, uh, in the corner, uh, we can put in an adapter to make this fit more snugly. Unfortunately, those adapters um, are not the right size for this one, so I'm not going to put that in. I'm just gonna put this here, and I'm going to try to arrange it so that most of the sample fits in most of that gap. So if we did this, we would be wasting um, this side. You can see that wouldn't be properly aligned with the hole in which the objective can move, whereas if we push it to the left, that's the proper arrangement for this sample. As far as keeping the lid on or off, if we were trying to image with DIC, uh, we would want to keep that lid uh, off. Uh, since we're not going to do that, we can just uh, leave it on and that's fine. One other thing I like to do uh, to make sure that the sample is as firm as possible. We have this uh, kind of putty, it's called blue tack. Um, it's usually uh, next to the oil bottle um, uh, to the right of the microscope. And I like making three small uh, pieces of it, put them there, and then using them to secure three corners of a sample, particularly if I'm going to do live cell imaging, just to add another layer uh, of security uh, to avoid things moving around too much. So I'm going to show you how I do that. I'm going to put, kind of put this down in one corner, and place that there, and then place this here in another corner. here in another corner, and if you're feeling paranoid, which I frequently am when doing live cell imaging, you can add another one at the connection between this and uh, sort of the, this insert on the other insert. So there we have sort of three things holding the sample and then three things holding the smaller insert to the bigger inserts. Again, this is just something that will add an extra measure of securing the sample so that it doesn't jostle around during live cell imaging. Let me cover this up. And so now that sample is ready to go.